It's day two and uh, it is it's 10 to 5 which means that I've not really done any filming today at all but that's for good reason because this morning the weather was how you say wet wet and cold yeah it was pretty miserable um, so miserable that I think we got two maybe four bits of footage um, so yeah but it's been a, it's been a long drivey day today so they've done two um, what do they call the challenges this special the stages special stages they've done two of those both the wet both of which were just complete washouts um, so not great for filming but now we are in the lovely village of Rock, rock foot something Rockford Terre, Terre, de terre. Rockford de Terre, <laughs> like Pomme de Terre, um, which is beautiful. Um, let me show you how beautiful. <laughs> I might even go as far as saying it's one of the most beautiful villages I've ever been to. Big statement, but I managed to get some good photos here. Rich has gone to take more photos. Rich has just been up a mountain taking photos. I was in a river taking photos, and Tim's been. <laughs> making his own artificial bushes to take photos, yeah. which is uh, which is quite good. Creative. So the focus for this video on day two, uh, towards the end of the day, is just to show you the beautiful cars that are rolling through, such as Don't this. idea that that is what was coming so I'm pretty pleased with that We've left the village of Rockfoot on Terre, which was lovely. Um, I've kind of come to the conclusion that filming today has been a bit of a failure, so uh, we're basically just going to head back to the hotel. We might see some cool cars on the way. Uh, if we do, we'll film those. Uh, but I'm going to merge day two and day three together, so I'll have a bit more of an effort of filming tomorrow, and uh, hopefully that'll be a bit more exciting. Tim, where are we going? Um, What's the name of the town we're going to? Nantes. Sorry? Nantes. 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 Please take the Ned. second exit. We're off to Nantes. What day is it? I have no idea. Thursday? Thursday? Yeah. Day three of driving. Three. It's about seven o'clock in the morning, so uh, a bit of a lie in this morning, which was nice. But we've decided <laughs> to start filming right a bit earlier today as the weather's nice.
incredible. But time to hit the road. We're gonna get our road book and head to stage one. I believe there are two special stages today and a racetrack. So a lot to, cram to try and cram into one day's filming. So we better hit the road. You are driving this bit? Yeah. Did you get some nice photos, Rich? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it was, uh, it was good. Good morning. Good morning. So we've stopped just outside the first stage to take some photos. And it sounds to me like we're about to see some fun cars drive past. on our way to the second checkpoint time? Yeah, the second stage. We couldn't really get to the first stage because it was so secluded. Uh, but we found ourselves amongst a nice little convoy of cars. Lunchtime checkpoint. Tim's there ready to take photos. Here comes Rich on his skateboard. forward cat isn't it? Aww. I like this cat. So we made it to the lunch stop and unfortunately although we are very special with our orange wristbands we're not special enough to get the lovely food that the drivers get which happens in there. Pretty cool little building. Um, but yeah, another little lineup. We thought there's probably not much point in going around and just filming all the cars again. So a bit like Le Mans, we're just going to kind of put a little plan together, grab our stuff, and crack on to the circuit. Yeah. Do you remember what the circuit's called? Val de Vienne, maybe. Something like that. Definitely, maybe. We'll let you know when we get back to the car. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we'll crack on. Go to the circuit. Where's the circuit? Où est le circuit? Val de Vienne. That Val de Vienne. Val de, Val de Vienne. The great thing about overtaking, overtaking tractors like this is you can just look through the middle. I think there is one car still to come. Just break into spot for you, Tim. And go, go, go! Circuit de Vienne. Val de Vienne, I do apologise. Ferraris and Porsches, just your random. Uh... It's amazing, isn't it? We've got so we've got modern supercars following following this rally. No, um, yeah. Often, I guessing. Well, a lot of them say like partners or sponsors. There we go. Perfect timing, just to show you the array of modern Ferraris. And in comparison. They're just so boring. Look at them all. There's even a LaFerrari in there somewhere, and it's just like not interested, not even interested in looking at that. So we've donned the lovely pink bibs, media bibs. I, uh, I personally quite like it. Taking a shiny to my pink bib, and here we are at the circuit. This 
car here, 911 Joy. We've had a fair few photos of this and uh, we can see they're from the UK, so we're going to go and have a, have a chat, say hello. Uh, with the crew or something? Uh, we're uh, press. So oh, super. Writing an article. Um, but yeah, it's great. First time yeah. I've been able to follow it. So. It's, a, it's a good event, actually. It's, it's pretty full on. It is, yeah. yeah. Up early. Go, 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 go. You guys driving a car where there's full concentration. Yeah. yeah. We're moaning and we're saying it's a nice comfy R6. So, yeah. About the third day, end of the third day, people start getting tired, they start making errors, but the specials, you know, it's really knocked out quite a few people. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yesterday it was really stuff. We had snow. It's crazy, wasn't it? Yeah. Some of the specials were fine. Quite tricky. Yeah. So, so long as we just stay on the tarmac. Excellent. Anyway. All right, let's stretch your legs. So whilst we are here, and you know we are surrounded once again by all the wonderful cars on the circuit, we kind of come to the conclusion that they're not circuits aren't really the best place for, for photos or videos, really, because you're just watching cars go by with very little happening in the background. But you know, we'll get what we can. We'll have a go. Have a go. Yeah. Jump in the car. Head on to the next one. Still, it's always fun to watch some cars rip around. All of the drivers have jumped in, so they're going to fire them up. And I have a feeling that it's going to sound uh, pretty incredible. Then when they go on the track, we'll go and film them on the track. Because I have a feeling that will also be pretty incredible. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Deafened. GT40. <laughs> so It. Done. Rich, you uh, you did a lap. Oh, I did a whole lap on yeah. your skateboard. I'm absolutely lapping. <laughs> Not a lap in a car, we should point out. Rich uh, lapped the circuit. Could you actually skateboard it, or did you have to walk oh, it? Oh no, I had to walk it the majority of it. I only got to skate a little bit. Ah, but we're all here now. That was absolutely brilliant. All much, much, much better than any of us thought it was going to be. Tim, where are we going now? Saint Martin. San Martin. Is that the last stop? That is the last special stage of the day before they head into Limoges. Now turn right. Almost there. Please follow the Metro. Oh, yes. it's a metro. Metro. As in a. Oh my God. A Rover, an actual Rover Metro. Quite good condition. And I'll be damned. So embarrassing. That is the spot of the week so far, an actual Rover Metro. So for the second time today, we have failed at getting to the stage. Um, so the second stage that we were supposed to get to, we've uh, also failed at getting to that. But it was for the same reason as the one this morning. It was in a really remote location, so there wasn't really anywhere for us to stop and park and have a look. Uh, but we have jumped out and taken some photos and things like that, but there wasn't really much to show you on the vlog. So we've made it to the finish line for day three, driving day three of Tour Auto. And let me show you where we are. Crap, I'm gonna 
a nice little crowd of people. It's like almost like Gumball. So this is Park Ferme, where all the cars get two hours to work on their car at the end of the day. Uh, if they go over two hours, then they incur time penalties. So it's an important part of the day, considering this is a rally based on timings. Indeed. Some uh, brake pad replacements, or shoe replacements, I should say. They're, they're, they're busy day, aren't they? Yeah. Soon. Oh no! Look at the Ferrari. Oh, golly gosh! Racing battle scars. This car. I'm not sure if I've actually mentioned this yet. This is definitely one to watch. So this. E-Type is being driven by a quite a famous French rally driver. He won the Tour Auto last year, so he's a competitor. Uh, he came first, and of course, our boys that we're supporting in the GT40, just there, uh, they want to win it this year. So basically, previous champion, existing champion, reigning champion, versus the Brit boys in the GT40 who want to take, their, take his spot. Obviously, we're supporting the GT40. Here it is. So, how's your day been today? Yeah, we've had a really good day, thanks. Um, we're sort of now we are where we are, which is we're well over halfway, which is a big milestone. Yeah. We're on the downhill to the finish. Yeah. And sort of from this morning onwards, our our aim is just to be really careful. You know, still go fast, still try and win in the special stages in the race. Um, but not, you know, not, not, not push it too much, so yeah. that we sort of create unnecessary, uh, unnecessary problems. And, uh, yeah, so we won both special stages and the and the um, and the race. Yeah. So we've added to our lead, and we haven't been caught speeding or anything like that on the road. <laughs> well, not that we know. But then again, we haven't been sped. We've been really careful about it. Shared driving. Andrew did one stage, I did the other, and I did the race. So yeah, just looking forward to tomorrow, really, because once tomorrow's out of the way, um, we really are on the main track. So that's us just about done. Day three of Tour Auto is finished. Thank you again very much for watching. Uh, if you want to see more of these, of course, subscribe, hit the little notify button, and all that, blah, 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 blah. Uh, be sure, as always, to check out Tim and Richie on their social media channels, uh, all of which are written below. And of course, most importantly, Private Motor Club, the magazine that we're working for this week, owned by Tim. Uh, again, all the social feeds below there, Basically, the Private Motor Club Instagram account is where you're going to see all of the best, most pretty, beautiful, lovely photos from the week so far. So thank you again for watching, and I will see you, well, maybe tomorrow. Cheers.